In this video, you will learn how to prepare the hand sanitizer from MTTS. The hand sanitizer system is designed to reduce the cost of infection control in newborn care units. The video will introduce you to the hand sanitizer kit, which includes all the ingredients and tools you'll need to make hand sanitizer solution other than the 70% alcohol which your hospital can source locally. The kit includes a supply of either 100 milliliter or 400 milliliter bottles of concentrated hand sanitizer, a 7 liter mixing container, an alcohol meter to measure the strength of the locally sourced alcohol to ensure it is 70% a blender for mixing the alcohol with the concentrate, a supply of 400 milliliter dispenser bottles, bed and wall hangers used to hang the dispensers on all baby beds and key locations, such as the entrance to the unit or at the hand washing area. To make the hand sanitizer, you need one bottle of concentrate and the seven liter mixing container as well as the blender and the alcohol meter that are provided in the kit. You will also need to source your own 70% isopropanol or ethanol. It is common that the percentage of alcohol is incorrectly labelled by suppliers, so you must ensure that you have 70% alcohol. In order to check your alcohol concentration, put the alcohol meter in the 7 litre container. If you cannot place the alcohol meter directly in the 7 litre container, pour the alcohol into a tall glass beaker and place the alcohol meter into the beaker. In both cases, the meter will float in the alcohol and will come to a rest with a measurement on the line indicating the strength of the alcohol. In this example, the alcohol is 70%. If the alcohol the hospital purchases is stronger than 70%, you will need to dilute it using distilled water or bottled drinking water if distilled water is not available. To dilute the alcohol down to 70%, simply add small amounts of water until the alcohol meter rests at 70%. Once you have determined that you have 70% alcohol, you are now ready to mix the solution. One bottle of concentrate is to be mixed with your 7 litres of alcohol in order to create approximately 7 litres of hand sanitizer. Both the 100 milliliter and 400 milliliter bottles of concentrate produce 7 litres of hand sanitizer. Remove the cap of the 7 litre container and ensure that the container is clean. Pour 7 litres of your locally sourced isopropanol or ethanol alcohol into the 7 litre container. Shake the concentrate bottle and pour the entire contents into the 7 litre container. Rinse the concentrate bottle with alcohol from the 7 litre container and pour it back into the 7 litre container to ensure that all the concentrate has been used. Now you will need to ensure that the alcohol and concentrate are well mixed and you can do this in one of two ways, either with a blender or a manually. To use the blender, plug the device into an electrical source and place the tubing into the 7 litre container, ensuring that it reaches near the bottom. Turn on the blender and allow this to blend for 5 minutes. You can also mix the liquid without an electronic blender. To do so, close the top of the 7 litre container and cover the small hole with your finger. Pick up the 7 litre container keeping your finger on the top, turn it sideways and shake for one or two minutes. Now the hand sanitizer is ready for use and you can fill the dispenser bottles. To do so, remove the small plug at the top of the 7 litre container and fill the dispenser bottles using the tap at the bottom of the 7 litre container. You can also remove the top of the 7 litre container completely and pour the hand sanitizer into the dispenser bottles.
close the 7 liter container when not in use. Use the portable bottle hanger to hang the dispenser bottles in a place where it can be easily accessed by staff and visitors. The wall hangers can be put anywhere babies are being treated, including the entrance to the unit and all entryways inside the unit.